Hey, everybody, Constance Arnold, your success coach. I wanted to come on really quickly and just give you a little teaching that's going to help you uh, manifest from the inside out. Always remember, I have over 700, oh my goodness, 700 archive podcasts on the Law of Attraction Radio Network. Uh, but I want to teach you just a little bit about manifestation you know that's what that that's what everybody is looking for so this is just some new insight I'm setting myself because I don't want this to be any longer than 10 minutes so if you want anything to change it's going to have to be from the inside out here I go I'm setting if you want anything to change it's going to have to be from the inside out whether it's weight health uh, money new career is going to start inside so everything is energy so it sounds like to me that if you want to change something you have to first change the energy that is on the inside of you what is energy energy would be your vibrations your mindset your paradigms your way of thinking uh, your perspectives you're going to have to change the energy on the inside. So, so many people, let's just say, for example, losing weight, they, they will say, well, Constance, I'm going to join Weight Watchers. I'm going to join a fitness gym and I'm going to start walking. And all of that is commendable. But you first need to change. What are your beliefs about losing weight? What are your core beliefs? What are you, what are you what what are the images? I got that out that you have around you. Are your images? You know what happened to you the last time, and in your lifetime, you probably have lost over a thousand pounds. What is your self talk? That's what I mean by energy. What is your self talk? What is your thinking? What is your mindset? What are your core beliefs? around what you desire so that's why people are so frustrated because you cannot manifest in the beta or the conscious world that's only five percent of who you really are your subconscious you've heard me say that directs and controls 95 percent of who you are your behavior your decisions and your choices so the first way, I'm looking at my notes, the, one of the first things that you can do to change from the inside is to change your thinking. Uh, we know your thinking precedes your manifestation. What can you replace those all old negative thoughts with about whatever you want your manifestation to be, whether it's money, whether it's abundance, whether it's love, what has your thinking been? Where have you been dwelling, living, thinking, and feeling in your mind, in your imagination, in your beliefs around the thing that you want to manifest? So change your thinking, change your world. So this is what I tell people. Write down what you want. You do not have to know how I want to make an extra thousand dollars a month. I want to release 15 pounds by the end of the year. Get a blank piece of paper. Do I have a blank? Get a piece of paper and just write down what what are your beliefs about what you want? I got a blank piece of paper. So you see on one side, you're going to put your old beliefs over here, your new empowering beliefs. Well, my beliefs around attracting money is I don't have a degree. That's my old belief. Uh, you got to work hard. Uh, they're not promoting in my company. I haven't been in my company long, whatever they are. I can never start my own business identify what your beliefs because your beliefs 
create how you feel. Your beliefs create your thinking. Your beliefs creates images on the inside of you staying on that job. So on one side, you're going to write down what your old beliefs are and what could your new empowering beliefs be? Well, I'm one with God and one with all there is. And God says all things are possible. So I believe that it is possible for me to start my own business. Or uh, I can hone my skills so that I could get promoted. You see what we're doing? We're changing our thinking. We're changing our images. We're changing what we're thinking about, what we're dwelling on all day. So once you've written down those empowering beliefs, I want you to meditate on them, think on them, roll them around in your mind, begin to speak them out loud. I am, I am healthy and at my ideal weight. I am vibrant, heal, and whole. Whatever, whatever your new empowering beliefs are, you're going to write them down, meditate on them, think about them. And then one of the most important things that you can do is to put yourself in the theta state. The alpha and the theta state, I got that out, are the most relaxed states. And they are the states that shift, impact, uh, impress tattoo your new empowering beliefs on your subconscious mind so before you go to bed or sometime during the day you can go on youtube and get any kind of instrumental music i do and just that puts you in the theta state they got theta and alpha state waves that you can listen to see yourself already living, being, and doing that new empowering beliefs. What are you doing when you do that? You are shifting energy from the inside out. You're changing your thinking. So you see yourself already healthy in your mind once you're in the theta state. You see yourself already able to walk walk fast. You see uh, your husband saying to you, baby, Wow, you look great. You see your coworker saying to you, what are you doing? You've lost so much weight. So in that theta state, we know that children live in the theta state up until they're seven. That's why their little brains, they can learn seven languages. They believe everything that happens to them when they're in that state. They are... Uh, they're open to play 10 different in instruments. So it's in the theta state, which is just before you wake up or just before you go to bed that you're shifting and changing your energy. A scientist said that when you just shift and change your thinking just a little bit, you're rearranging atoms to align with your desire. So every day, take five minutes. You got five minutes, don't you? I'm going to say if you have time, do it twice a day. Get yourself in that theta state. For me, going to bed doesn't work. You know, going to doing it just before I go to bed doesn't work for me. I do. I normally do it during the day, twice a day. And while the miraculous happens, I have a client in Nashville and she's just talking about how her life is really changing rapidly because we've been trying to use, bring about change matter, change and matter. But what we're doing is energy, EM squ EMC squared, we are light, energy on the inside is shifting and changing and rearranging matter and manifestations. Hey guys, that's all I'm going to say on that. If you would like to coach with me, I'm coaching people on five continents and all areas, helping them to create wealth, abundance, start new businesses, attract love. I'm a certified dream coach, certified law of attraction coach, coach and of, of course I'm talking too fast and of course a master's level counselor uh, email me at constant at fulfillingyourpurpose.com let's do a discovery call if you're ready for the investment if you're ready for change if you're ready to do the inner work you can live 
any life. You can create and live any life that you desire.